Hi, this is Brady, and today my mom is going to show you how to use pig collages. Okay, so this is Pig Collage. I love it. It's a free app. You can download it from the App Store. And basically, it allows you to make anything like super cute in pictures, and you can add words to it. And so this just shows you kind of the first page that you go into. I usually pick freestyle, and these are all my different freestyle things I've created. I just use it so much for my direct sales business. And so I use it a lot for shout outs for my team. So this is like an example of a shout out I'd give my team on our private Facebook page. And so I'm gonna just show you how to take this just regular shout out and kind of even up the ante on it and make it even cuter than just this. So what I'm first gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to dress it up by adding some pictures. So first you go in here and you click on that little clip art icon. And then when you get in there, you see all different like, they have like free clip arts. They have ones you can buy, but I never buy them. I just take the free ones. And so I'm gonna pick like four different ones. These are the four I wanna kind of throw in and make it look like super cute. So you just click on those and then you hit the check mark and throws them right onto your pick collage, right in the middle. And you're like, wait, that's a mess. <laughs> so you just have to like click on them. You just hold them with your finger and move them until they're like in the right places. So. See how this looks cute now, but the problem is it doesn't match my background. Now we have a big hot mess, so now we have to fix that. So I go back in here, you just click plus at the bottom and you go to background. And then when you're in background, it gives you different options. You can pick from like ones that they already have, but I like to be a little more strategic and find even more like awesomer ones. So I go into the search, there's a little search thing, and they pick, you can pick from all different kinds, but I go right to the top and I always like to use sparkle backgrounds. So this one I need aqua sparkle to match my aqua wording. But I do pink sparkle, white sparkle, any sparkle. So you type that in and look at all my different options now. Oh, doesn't this excite you? So all these different aqua sparkles I can use. So great, so I pick the one that I like, and you click on it and it adds it to my background. Ooh, see it's starting to match a little better. Isn't that pretty? So then I'm like, okay, now let's look at this word Michelle at the bottom. Hmm, that needs to change. So I just changed it. I changed the background on it to gold and the font is white there. So it's starting to look a little prettier. Oh, now, oh, it's really starting to look like matchy matchy. So you can just change and you can change anything so quickly and easily. And at the top here, I just changed that to an aqua color so it kind of matches my background. I think like just having like coordinating colors makes it look super cute. Now, I'm gonna add some photos. So I went in, you can just click photos, add them in. So I added these photos in, but this photo on the top there it needs to be cropped so I go right into effects click on that and then when you're in effects you're gonna see if you scroll over across the bottom there's gonna be something called crop and so here I am just cropping that so it's perfect so that it's gonna look good on the picture so see now it looks pretty now it's perfectly centered and perfect so that's on the picture now now I'm gonna show you how to put them side by side so you can see my before and my after so I just clicked on the two different photos and now I have them side by side, but look at the one on the right, it needs to be cropped. So hold on a second, let me fix that, cropping it up to make it perfect. So easy to crop and make things look pretty. And you can do this in just a few minutes. So now there's my before. If you wanna add the word before and the add word after, down at the bottom here, you could change the fonts on anything. So, oh, I just changed the word before, I used a different font. So that's my before, it was kind of just plain, it was still pretty. So great, but this one is prettier. This is like, whoa, I got artwork, I got pictures, and we're talking it only took me about 30 more seconds to do that. So then you go to really? see so what's it gonna do? So a copy in your photos so, that you can then like, share on Facebook. So, like a, a rocket you, uses fire, and mm -hmm. um, this uses fireworks to help it fly higher than a rocket. That's amazing. Is it gonna do this in the house? What? Will it do it inside the house? Nope. It's gonna go outside only because it can be pretty dangerous, and you have to take off when no people are around you. Okay, got it. When will it be ready? Mm, in a few more minutes. Okay, just let me know and we'll go outside and do it. 